Welcome to Magoosh. This is Kat. I'm one of the MCAT experts here, and I'd like to show you around a little bit so you know what you can expect and how you can use your Magoosh MCAT prep course. You can see I'm currently at the main dashboard, and I'm following the MCAT six-month study schedule. I'm on day one. You can always change your plan here if you want to choose a different time frame for your schedule and you can use this course without using a study schedule at all. But one thing that's nice about this is you have a daily uh, checklist and these links take you exactly where you need to go. So for instance, if we click right here to the MCAT study schedule, we're taken directly to the lesson and you can see there's a note box here where you can save your notes for each lesson. And then down here, there's a transcript. You can advance it to the exact place you want to go to on the lesson, and you can uh, change the playback speed. And then once you go back to the dashboard, you'll see that the lesson has already been clicked as watched. You can also navigate the lessons this way. Here you can see uh, we've got six major categories of lessons, so the four exam sections, but also an intro and scientific reasoning section. And we're currently on the chemistry and physics lessons page, and we've got many lessons. In total, we have almost 400 lessons in the course. To answer questions, you have a couple options. You can go up here to practice and then choose whether you want to do a regular practice test, which will time you, it'll have all four sections, or do custom practice. This is custom practice, and you can basically set up how long you want to study for and whether you want to see questions you've already answered or haven't and what section you want to practice. From your main dashboard you can also just choose to practice by clicking on one of these green boxes. And here's a passage-based question. So the passage is here on the left, uh, the questions on the right, you've got a highlighting tool, uh, you can take a note here if you want and submit your answer and I got that one wrong. So I scrolled down, I can see it was considered a medium difficulty question, and that's based on how other Magush students have answered it. My piece was 27 seconds, which was under the average. We've got a really detailed text explanation here. And for most of our questions, you'll also see links to related lessons. So if I want to avoid missing questions like that in the future, I might want to take a look at cellular reproduction in the cellular reproduction series. Now we're up at the review tab. And this is a way for you to just go back and, and look at the questions that you've missed or answered correctly in the past. Maybe you want to see how many medium difficulty questions have I answered uh, incorrectly over the past 30 days in the biology section. And then that will pull up your list of questions. We have a list of resources here, and this includes things like must watch lessons, which are kind of the high yield lessons. We have flashcards, which can be viewed as an app or online and several others, and we're always adding more. The last thing you should know about is the help button. You'll always see this help option. So that's even if you're in the middle of a practice test, you can always click on this button and this window will pop up uh, and you just sort of say something about a question you might have. So this could be related to your user experience, your account, or they can be content related questions. We have a team of test experts who are highly experienced. Most of them have taken the MCAT quite recently. And you just say a little bit about what the subject is and what your question is, and someone will get back with you. Okay, good luck with studying, and let us know if we can help you in any way.